In Photoshop, patterns can be created with shapes, text, pictures, or drawings. Although Photoshop comes with its own set of patterns, the selection is small. The following steps demonstrate how to create your own unique pattern. Patterns can be utilized as a background of an image or design, for special effects, or as a means of visual expression. To create the original design for the pattern using vector shapes, click on the File menu. Then select New. Set the width and height to 1 inches, the resolution to 300 pixels per inch, the color mode to RGB color, and set the background contents to white. When finished, click on the OK button. Make sure that the Shape tool is selected, and in the Options bar, select the Ellipse tool. Bring your cursor to the canvas, and draw a perfect circle by holding down the Shift key on your keyboard. Then select the Move tool. Back on the canvas, Hold down Alt plus the Shift key and drag the elliptical shape to create a copy in the lower right corner of the canvas. I'm going to double click on the color panel in order to collapse it. Then in the layers panel, click on the flyout menu and select flatten image. Now we're ready to define our pattern. Go to the edit menu and select define pattern. Let's name our pattern dots, then select the OK button. Now that we've defined our pattern, let's create it. Click on the File menu, then select New. Let's set our width to 8 inches and our height to 11 inches. When finished, click on the OK button. Click on the Edit menu and select Fill. In the Fill dialog box, click on the Use drop-down arrow. Then select Pattern. Click on the new drop-down arrow that appears called Custom Pattern. The last pattern in the Pattern Gallery is the one that we just created. Go ahead and click on it. In order to delete an unwanted pattern, Right-click on it, then select Delete Pattern. When finished, click on the OK button. Now let's add a filter for added visual effect. Go to the Filter menu, scroll down to Distort, and select Sphere Eyes. You can adjust the amount, but if you like the way it looks as it is, go ahead and click on the OK button.